हाई फ्रेंड्स टूडे इज द माई फर्स्ट लेसन सो आई विल टीच यू फ्रॉम एंड टू एंड अकाउंटिंग विथ इंक्लूडिंग ऑफ ऑल टैक्सेशन द फर्स्ट विल लर्न हाउ टू क्रिएट कंपनी इन टैली आर पी नाइन सो हियर द स्क्रीन इज देर हियर विल गेट दी ऑप्शन फर्स्ट सेलेक्ट दी कंपनी इफ वी हैव ऑलरेडी क्रिएटेड वी कैन सी हियर वॉट कंपनीज वी हैव क्रिएटेड ऑलरेडी okay so if you want post the ledgers in this abc limited we can open it or else if you want to create new company just click on alt f3 we'll get the options okay here we'll get the options create a company so enter and here we'll create one company here we'll get all the options so address hyderabad and pin code state we'll get all telangana and here pin code 500081 so we can fill so all the necessary fields so here here two options is there maintain so if you don't want to maintain inventory don't choose this accounts with inventory if you choose also nothing will happen so better to select accounts with inventory okay enter press enter 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 yes yes now company is created see if you don't want to see this abc limited company we can shut down that company so fresh alt f1 alt f1 so just click on abc limited so there is no confusion so now we'll clear the masters okay to create the masters go to the accounts info ledgers create here first we'll create some expenditure ledgers the first telephone expenses telephone expenses so enter in direct expenses okay See here we have the options. So that is inventory values are affected. So this is not related to any inventory. So we don't want to select anything here. You just press enter, 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 and we'll create one more office expenses. Says. and we'll create one bank bank account so here we'll create as as d f c bank under bank accounts here we have options bank accounts and bank od this is not od account so we'll create this under bank accounts okay so effect date from reconciliation the books will start from which year for example if we'll take first april 2014 you can select here if you want to alter any bank details we can choose as year okay this i'll uh, i'll give clarity on this in depth later so 
first we will create the bank okay so we have created bank and two expenditure ledgers okay mm -hmm. come back to come back the main screen fresh escape okay here we can see if we want to see created ledgers go to accounts info ledgers display or alter display here we can see bank is there office expenses is there and telephone is there so here by default cash and profit profit and loss account will be there in the same list and come back and uh, a display here uh, uh, through display we can only see so we cannot change we cannot change so if you want to change any alteration so go to alter okay here we can see suppose office expenses here we can change what are the group or anything you can change here so now we don't want to change anything okay now we'll post one cash entry so now we don't have any cash balance right if you see here nothing is there so we'll create one for our reference we'll create one ledger monster ledger create for example capital under capital account i have created capital capital account so we'll post one entry so before st starting any business so we have to bring some capital okay so we'll post one entry vouchers to post any accounting vouchers go to accounting vouchers enter and now f6 here we'll get option f6 receipts here cash and as a capital we are putting some capital for uh, daily activities and day to day transactions and day to day business activities so here we'll take some around 5 lakhs okay enter enter okay now if you go display display account books cash and bank here we will see the balances see we have now we have cash of 5 lakhs so now we will post expenditure vouchers so come back back and here accounting vouchers f6 so here we are posting payments so f5 f5 for payment please remember here through how we are posting cash and telephone expenses telephone expenses 2000 rupees okay see if you see the before posting this ledger our cash balance is 5 lakhs now i have posted telephone expenses 2000 rupees so automatically we can see here how much cash we have in hand 4 lakhs 98 from 5 lakhs 2 lakhs automatically reduced 
so come to narration being telephone charges paid for the month of April April 2014 press enter enter so now we created masters and we have posted vouchers we'll see we'll see the cash balance to see the cash balance display okay first display account books cash Let's see here four lakhs ninety eight thousand okay cash should be debit balance always cash should be debit balance okay here debit is there okay and come back and ledgers if you want to see any ledger transactions now we have already posted telephone expenses and select this one enter see this we have posted 2000 rupees like this we can check the ledger balance as well and the same it will affect to p and l so if you want to p and l profit and loss account if you see here profit and loss account just click this okay. here we can see under we created this ledger under indirect expenses so this is the main group indirect expenses is main group okay if you enter on this we'll get all these expenses ledgers see here we have created only telephone expenses so that's what we can able to see here under indirect expenses we'll post one more ledger so we'll see go to account watchers and here same cash cash transaction office expenses 2000 or 1500 rupees we'll take okay being cash paid towards office expenses okay press enter enter okay now we'll see the reports we'll see the first cash balance okay go to the display account books cash and bank see automatically balance will reduce from cash okay come back go to P&L under this both ledgers we created under indirect expenses if you press enter here we can see all these telephone is there office expenses there so like that we'll get all breakup so based on the group we can able to see the all the ledgers and their balances okay thank you for watching this video thank you